Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Alicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. How Percy are you feeling? Because I'm feeling Percy. And today, in memory of my beloved mother, um, if you had, if you don't know, she did uh, pass away uh, completely unexpectedly. Um, I don't know why. No, no real reason. Um, just happened. Freak accident. I guess. I don't know. Um. But I thought it would be fun to try and do a lighthearted video and try to do like a video in her memory and um, show you guys her favorite bag that was in my collection. So I remember, I distinctly remember her saying which bag was her favorite in my collection and the one that she wanted most if... You know if I ever were were to get rid of it but um obviously that's now not gonna happen but um I thought it would be fun to try and do a what would be inside my mother's purse video so we're gonna hop into her favorite bag in my collection and go through the bag that would possibly have been hers in the future. Mother! The ship will automatically destruct. You bitch! But before we hop into the video today, if you guys love handbags, hauls, luxury, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy today's content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoyed today's video and it helps with that ever changing, ever growing YouTube L go rhythm. 20 seconds. y'all know exactly what time it is it's time to get Percy and we're gonna be getting Percy in a sentimental way today so firstly let's talk about um the purse that my mom wanted and her favorite one <laughs> um it is the Christian Dior got dice gambler bowler bag this was her favorite she totally let me know this was her favorite. She wanted this. I know, I know she wanted this if I ever let good, if I were to ever have gotten rid of it. But in all honesty, I don't know if I ever would have, but I feel like if she had ever pushed enough, I probably would have, you know what I mean? I'm very giving when it comes to family and you know, I got, I got, I got a lot of purses and it, it wouldn't be a sweat off my back if she did get this. But unfortunately, it, life throws curveballs and really big ones. So this was her favorite. And, you know, I this is also one of my favorites, actually. Um, it, it's a beautiful bag. So I honestly couldn't even blame her for actually this being her favorite and her wanting it. But as we all know, mothers like to carry some things in their purses. Girl, my mom used to carry, like, literally everything. I I know somebody out there likes to put their whole house in their bag. And, you know, I have to say, my mom was probably the same. My mom was the same way. She always had shit falling out of her purse. Her wallet was just so overflowing with receipts and cards and honestly just so much crap <laughs> oh man uh, she was a little ridiculous like that but this is what i would find in my mother's purse so first up 
to be in my mom's purse would be just a loose set of keys with probably a key to everything she's ever had in her entire life. And then after that, she would have her lint roller. As much as she loved her animals, she really hated the hair. So she always had a lint roller. I remember that. And then obviously she would have like a little mirror, like a little compact mirror. Now I don't really have a compact mirror, but I have my Kate Spade mirror card case. So, you know, next best thing, right? And then she would have her wallet. And as I stated, her wallet would be literally overflowing. It would literally be like a, um, what is it? Jack in the box where you, you spin it and then it just like explodes. It would be like a confetti confetti like a confetti gun but also what she would have randomly laying around in her purse would be jewelry as well as her sunglass case with her Prada sunglasses that are now mine and I will cherish them for a very long time and then after that she would have nail clippers because you know you got to keep the nails fresh and then she would have a nose trimmer, hairy beast. And then she would have a razor and then shaving cream. Cause you know, some winters are pretty long. Some winters can be long here in Canada. So, you know, a can of cat food because she loved to feed the strays. So she always carried a can of cat food. I can't tell if it's pate or giblets for the cats. How is Big Edie doing? She's always begging for the pate, but the label is faded. I can never tell if it's pate or if it's giblets for the cats. And then she had a giant pad of paper. Always. A box of receipts. A giant bottle of multi-purpose pills. Her lucky vase. And then... Lastly, Newton, Mr. Newton. Yes, um, I, uh, my mom before passing had just got a cat. So, um, I'm, I decided that I wanted to take him and take care of him and love him and cherish him and, you know, um, I didn't get to say goodbye to my mom. I didn't get to do any of that. So I've been having a really hard time the last few days trying to get in front of the camera. I feel like I look really disheveled. I'm trying to grow a mustache. I don't even know why. I just, you know, I'm, 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 if you guys know, I like to experiment with like my aesthetics and stuff often. So, you know, I'm kind of like experimenting with my facial hair. But, um, it's been tough. It's been really, really tough. Um, I just, you know, um, I've had to rely on her to give me strength today because I'm just, uh, it's been really tough, guys. I couldn't, if it wasn't for her helping me today, I honestly would not have been able to get on camera and film this for you because I have been crying a lot. I've been not doing well. Honestly, I've not been doing well. Um, things have been tough, you know. This was very unexpected. This was very abrupt. Like, there was just, I don't, I just, I don't know, guys. Like, it's been tough, so... I hope you guys enjoyed this light-hearted video. Shout out to my Aunt Jen. She helped make this silly video. She helped give me the idea for it because she firsthand knows how ridiculous my mom's purse would actually be. And, you know, um, she actually still has purses laying around the house that are just filled with junk. <laughs> just stupid shit. Thank you all for the really kind messages you've all left me. Um, you guys have been very, very kind. And as always, you guys are always very kind. And I noticed some people donated uh, to the GoFundMe. And thank you. 
thank you. Like, I really do appreciate it. Like, when I say, like, this was abrupt, like, it... Part of me is happy to be in front of the camera. And, you know, I haven't cried today, so... Again, I thank my mother. Thank you, Mom, for lending me your strength to do all of this. And I love you. But anyways, let me quickly hop into the outfit of the day with my mother's favorite purse. Don't believe in you, but all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred, hundred, hundred people, a 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 hundred people. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's silly, um, fun, lighthearted, uh, semi-serious video. Um, this is basically kind of nice little memorial to my mom. I might try to do a couple new videos about my mom, like, you know, uh, my mom's purse collection or something, you know, she never did designer purses, she never had anything fancy, but, you know, I had the, I have the fancy purses, so, um, if you guys are interested in that, I would, honestly, I would like to do that. The woman was a woman, let's just say that. <laughs> But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's video, please hit the subscribe button if you're new. Hit that like button, share with your friends and family, comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's outfit of the day, uh, kittylicious moment of the day, or, you know, the fun memorial to my mother. As well, you can always support me and the channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation. And you can check out the description box below for the three lucky links. Join Instagram, Facebook, and Discord. Notification squad, I love you all to the absolute moon and back. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye! I think it was good. I don't, I don't know. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's over. See you next Taco Tuesday, bitch.